is Optimus Prime. are in danger hello and welcome to a video made by me today we're reviewing siege galaxy upgrade optimus prime or just was it super mode Optimus? it doesn't matter here he is he's cool i have more to say uh really cool figure first uh standard procedure Look at the articulation. I'm just gonna start him off in super mode because I cause you can do a uh, do a kick. You can, you can uh, let's, oh well, he can do this. You can put you can put these guns back. Hold on, you got him. There you go. All right. Get him a good T pose. All right, so you can kick sideways. Cannot kick back. Uh, well, easy. Uh, and so you can get about half, like a quarter. Uh, right, you can do a kick. Do an, I think this is a ninety degree knee bend. Uh. He does not have a ankle tilt on his armor piece, but he does here. He has rotating shoulders. They can spin a full 360. Uh, his arms can go up and down. He's got a 90. He's got a 90 elbow. Hands swivel all the way around, although they can be a little bit stiff. He can flap his wings. He can flip his guns out, which I'm not going to do right now. Uh, he has a waist swivel. Waist swivel. Uh, head articulation. He's on a ball joint. So he can rotate. Um, so yeah, let's get into the details. So, anyways, as I was saying, detail time, shoulders, or the shoulder pads, um, pretty well painted, pretty detailed, the window's got a nice blue, uh, and a white, head is lovely sculpted, it's amazing, the, e the ear things were amazing, the paint is not, that it's amazing, I'm, for some reason, I was going to say horrendous, and it's not horrendous. It's amazing. Nice paint. Clear plastic for the windows. This actually makes sense, and it looks good to lots of modern figures now. Um, lots of nice silver paint. Lots of nice chest, or not chest, stomach details with the grill. Here, if I can really focus, you get a look at that. We also have some light details here. Pretty good. His crotch piece also has lots of details. This is just an all-around good figure. A little bit of hollowness, but that section, that's not bad. It's not bad hollowness. Uh, some nice mechanical detail on the leg here. Uh, nice front leg detail with the, like, grill. I don't know. I don't know what you call them. Wheels are nicely sculpted. Yeah, I'm not focus. It will. Okay. And, uh, I think that's everything. Oh, wait, I forgot to look at the guns. Here. Yeah. Or blasters. You should be better not to monetize this. Uh, lo lovely mechanical detail. It's really good. Really good. Wings are also really good mechanical detail. But, yeah. So, uh, let's make him Chunky Prime. So, as I was saying, let's transform him. So, First off, we want to unpeg these two tabs in his chest. So, like that. Then we just pull his back piece off. Next up, uh, well, you can just chuck this to the side. It's not needed anymore until vehicle transformation. You can take these shoulders off. Not too hard. 
Then we take his hip, or like his cross panel. We unpeg it and then we twist this around. We now have a different crotch, which is also nicely painted and detailed. We take off his knuckles, his, like, his pieces. Lots of parts forming, but I don't feel us. Next, take off his shoes. I like to keep them on, personally, but that's not how you do it. You take this piece and push it up. Uh, hold up. Give me five seconds. Right. Here we go. Took off my mask real quick. Uh, you have to. So, you have to uh, pull his chest forward like that then this can go up this can go up and then you can put this back and then he now has a backpack um and then actually you can take his knuckles you can pull them up and you can shove them on the back here I, again i don't know if it's needed because i know i know it's like a transformation thing but can do that and that's what i'm going to do next up what you're gonna do is uh you're gonna pull his chest apart make sure to untab these then unpeg it here we go then you flip his head out and then you uh just plug it in there we go. Oh, wait, oh, and, uh, forgot to do that, but, uh, flip out his, uh, his heels. Flip out his heels. There we got. There we go. We got, um, Chunky Prime. He's goofy. I love him for it. He's so goofy. Like, he's just a goofy little guy. He's so chubby. So, uh. Look at the details. Legs really nice. Not hollow. They are not hollow. They're actually like they're really good legs. I like these. Definitely better than Earthrise. Even though that doesn't have any hollow bits, I think. Yeah. Uh oh wait. Size comparison. Forgot to do that. He's in small boy mode now, so I'm gonna do it because well, it's not even fair. There's G2 Laser Prime. And here's Earthrise Prime. He's pretty short. But if we put on his big boy shoes, if we put on his big boy shoes, He is equal height, if not taller. Sometimes you just can't pose him right. You gotta separate the legs a little bit. He's got his clown shoes on. Uh, so yeah, he's pretty equal height with them. He's taller with the thing on, but I am not putting that back on just to show a size comparison. No way. So, uh... Yeah, let's just get these two out of here. And then we're going to show off the transformation. Okay. Save, he fell over. Whatever. Anyways, so first step, flipping his heels. I already have mine flipped in, but flip in those if you haven't, and peg in the legs. Next, you're going to want to open up Z chest cavity. Make sure that. Yep, yeah, all right, that's okay. Hold on. See, sometimes Prime just doesn't like to cooperate. Oh, 
Oh, play that maybe. Again, sometimes it just doesn't like to cooperate. Give me five seconds to get this chest open. All right, got it open finally. Okay, so then you have flip in his head, then you peg it back in. Next up, you make his arms do this. Oh, wait, actually, like that. So, you make his arms like that, and you peg this in into these. There's these tabs, which one of these holes. So, just do that. Next. Extend him forward after rotating the torso. After ro after rotating him 360 on the bicep swivel, push him, slide him forward, and then you got the front of the truck. Uh, you can flip the crotch piece back, and I just flipped it out for. You don't need to flip it, but uh, might help. Uh. Might be recommended to flip out this crotch piece and replace it with the other one. Because that is flatter. Unpeg the legs because I'm stupid and I forgot there are these tiny little pegs in here. So you need to tab these in here. Anyways, do any adjustments to fix it because it might have been ro it might have rotated and stuff while you're transforming him and uh well done now i'm not gonna do size comparison in car mode because i already did check out my laser prime video if you want uh car mode comparisons so uh, yeah but we'll compare him with legacy skates they're both small little guys here let's just all right here we go. Sorry for the hand coverage. But, yep. Yeah. Skids. And, uh, yeah. He's he's a goofy, derpy little truck. Now let's get into the trailer mode. This time I'm not going to do a cut. You need to yoinkity spoinkity his legs. And his shoulder pads. Here, let's move this chest out of there. And Warpath, stop. You're being stupid. Okay, you know what? Whatever. That's fine. These panels, they don't do anything. Just to let you know. So, don't, don't worry. Uh, so first off, you gotta put these, uh, panels in his legs. Like, uh, hold on. Like this. So it should look like this. And then do the same for the other piece, or the other leg, like so. If these don't fall out, they fall out very easily. So, well then, don't worry, you're not doing anything wrong, unless you're putting it in the wrong way, which then, yeah, you are, but... Anyways, then peg these together. You have your back part of the trailer. Next up, you have your piece. Alright. So, this step for lots of people um, is forgettable. But, we're going to do it here. We're going to extend this. Because I'm going to put these to the side. Alright, so take off his guns. Or, I mean, blasters off his wings. Uh, which these do have five millimeter ports on them, so you can even put what you want on them. I can put mine there. Next up, you fold his head thing back. Then you rotate this. Next, you fold this in, and you fold this flat. You now have him kind of like that. Next up. You have these things. 
These are useful. You're gonna want to, uh, you're gonna wanna do this. You're gonna, do, you're gonna wanna flip these in, flip the, your wings like that. I do it because it personally, I find it easier. And you're gonna wanna flip, originally it's gonna, hold up. Originally, this is gonna look like this. So just unfold it. And then move it forward you should, to where the head is, sort of. So should you should end up having it look like this, just so the guns don't get in the way. Move them there. Next up, you have these. These are gonna plug into ports in the back of the legs, right there. You can slide them in, you can plug them in, do not care. Do it your way. Because they can both slide in and plug in. I find it sort of easy to both plug and slide them in. But, that's just me. There are also a tab here, so just slide this slot into this to this tab on the legs and yeah that's essentially your trailer done all right next up you actually need your car now or your truck or your truck so what you're gonna do is see this little rail thing you're gonna want to plug or slide or whatever you're going to plug this in to this a little gap but also, see this little bar thing in there? You're gonna wanna slide. You're gonna wanna slide this notch into this bar right here. Oh, also fold the wings out because they might get the truck caught on them. Oh, uh, see, the, the trailer kind of, I, I might not be transforming it right or like pl plugging it in properly but it is a little flimsy so hold on give me five seconds and i'll get this fixed all right got everything plugged in so uh yeah you're gonna want to slide Slide this into the notch, like so. Make sure that your feet on this are straight. Uh. Again. Sometimes it'll be a little annoying, but you're just going to get into that groove. Then, once you got that, this should cover the hands. And then you just got to plug this into that, the rail. Uh, then, last step, besides from when you plug this into the rail, you might experience it like push the cat or pull the cab back so you're just gonna have to push the cab forward next there are these two little tabs yeah i'll untab the wings to show people but two tabs two holes plug the tabs in the holes wow and then you are done with it it's finished so uh yeah size comparison time skids not skids and uh well here skids is gonna be our representation for prime today There you go. Skids. Skids with a trailer. 
but I mean it's it's roughly the same size. And even if you did it like this, hold up. Here, we're gonna flip out the stand for this. Just pretend Skids is telling it. All right, just pretend. All right, we're we're playing pretend. Just it's good enough. Uh, there. Uh, but flipping. It, it, that's still roughly the same size. Skids is a little bit farther because the, the foot, this has a pin. Or I could probably put that into laser prime, but whatever. Whatever. But, besides from that, it kind of, it would kind of look like this. Sort of, which is slightly longer than normal. Or than, uh, than Galaxy Prime, but whatever. Yeah, let's go with it. And, uh, yeah. We'll get all three of the primes in there. During the shot. So, uh, yeah. That's, that's him. That is Galaxy Upgrade Prime. So, uh, yeah. Make sure to like and subscribe, and, uh, yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. See ya. Oh, wait. Guns. You can peg them on him. Thanks for watching. Now get out!